A major step forward for South Burlington based Beta Technologies. The electric plane maker officially opened today to what it says is the country's first large scale facility of its kind. ABC 22's Isabel Shoneman tells us why the governor and Beta CEO say the company could quickly become one of the largest employers in the state. Isabel? Thanks, Lauren. The new production facility lies in South Burlington on airport grounds. Beta Technologies CEO Kyle Clark says the building was designed to be completely net zero and says this facility is the first of its kind in the nation. Clark even describes this milestone as the next important step in beating the climate crisis. A takeoff for Beta Technologies as it opens what it says is the first large scale electric aircraft production facility in the country. CEO Kyle Clark says Beta Technologies has come far since its beginning six years ago. As we built this company, we tried to do it incredibly thoughtfully in a science and data driven way with a clear clear mission at, at, at hand, which is to help turn the corner on climate change. Beta has built up a staff of nearly 600 across Vermont and in its flight training facility in Plattsburgh. We're just finishing up this building right now. And that wing jig, which is the first major tool of structures, gets complemented by another one next week. And in the weeks after, in the weeks after, we build that structure right here. And over the next quarter, this facility starts to fill out as we enter production. Clark says by 2027, the new facility will be able to produce 300 aircraft a year. In what many are calling a global climate crisis, Senator Bernie Sanders calls air travel one of the biggest emitters. We are leading the world in helping to transform our energy system away from fossil fuel and save the planet. And with a clean mission, the company's top supervisor and Vermont Governor Phil Scott say Beta will create thousands of jobs, even saying it has potential to become one of the largest employers in the state. It's this kind of creativity and ingenuity that gives me confidence that addressing climate change will also benefit the economy. These are the kind of jobs we need in Vermont. Clark and Burlington Mayor Moreau Weinberger call the new building highly engineered, designed to be completely net zero. Beta is proof positive that the innovative spirit of Vermont and Burlington can fuel the progressive climate policy that our state and our nation must embrace to avert future climate disasters. Looking into the future, Clark says production and the facility itself will only get bigger as the company continues to build more electric aircraft. Kyle Clark also says Beta Technologies holds a focus on employing young people and getting students into the workforce. He says about 3,000 students have toured the facility this year, and Senator Sanders says he's working on kickstarting an apprenticeship program in Vermont. Live in the studio, Isabel Schoneman, ABC 22 News.